Hi guys, in the previous lecture we have built this thing in the pricing page and now in this lecture we are gonna build this, uh, we are gonna give the style to this list and first of all I'm gonna give the style to this price item anchor tag we have give it the price item class here you can see that price item class is given to the anchor tag I'm gonna use this class and here it is price item here it is and here is give it to the float left and then here is the color is become gray here it is and then here is the text decoration none and here is the maximum width is 70 percent the width of the anchor tag and here is the margin 0 pixel and from the top and 6 pixel from the left side 0 pixel and 0 pixel from all the sides and now here you see that is 0 pixel here you can see that and the 6 pixel is added on the left side and now I'm gonna give the style when we take the mouse over this anchor tag so its color is become white so I'm gonna use this class here it is and here is the hover and here is its color is become white and here it is and now I'm gonna give the style to this price by using its call class name that is price here it is here I'm gonna show you here is the price is given to the price class is given to the price and here I'm gonna give it float right float to the right side so it will be on the right side and here is the margin I'm gonna give it the margin on the right side only here is the 6 pixel and here is the width is 60 pixel and here is the text align is to the left side text is started from the left side and here is hash b3 and here it is it is in the red color and now in between this I'm gonna place the dotted image so how to fill the dotted image here I have create a span and we are given we are gonna give the dotted image by using this class filler and I'm gonna give the dotted image in the background of the span here it is and now here is the display first of all I'm gonna give it the display block here is the display as a block and here is the background image here is the URL here it is images and here is the filler dot GIF and here is repeat in the x-axis in the x-axis direction and here is the bottom so in the y-axis it is on the bottom and here I'm gonna read out it so now I'm gonna give it some height then it will be shown to you here is the height here is the 15 pixel and then here is the overflow hidden so now let's reload it and here you see that these dots have not enough width like these dots so why it is happening because the whole width of this div is 66 percent and we have to give the 50 percent of this div to this list but we are using this adjust 3 so it is not giving the proper 50% of the 66% so now here I'm gonna give 
the five are just five and I am gonna create another adjust five and it will give the 50% width here it is and now here it is and now I'm gonna increase this list here you see that it is created these this dot is an image and I have give this dotted image in the background of this pen by using its class filler and now here I want to tell you another thing that this image is too small we cannot see it here I'm gonna show you this image here is the image here is this and this is a simple dot here it is GIF type that why it is loaded here here I'm gonna zoom it then this is the dot here you can see that this is this tiny dot we have give it the height and width to this pen that's why it is shown like this and it this dot is repeated over the screen and now let's increase this list and here is this list item and here is the UL and now here I'm gonna increase it third four five six seven eight here I have created the eight and here is load it first of all save it then reload it so here it is created and now here I'm gonna increase more here it is copy and paste it paste it here and here is this and reload it and here now we have to create the second list you can change this text easily process and now we have to create the second list so now what we need to do we have to copy this adjust 5 div here is copy this and here is the ul and all the things and here is this copy it and then here is in between this we have to paste it and then here reduce the list items in this list and now here is the second one and here it is and now both are looking same so now this is ready and now in the next lecture we are gonna build this contact.html here you can see that we will build this form and this description list so thank you for watching this video i will see you in the next video